The collars work. Electric shock collars are worn around the dog's neck and deliver an electric shock by a remote control or automatic trigger. For example, if a dog were to bark. They're not available in pet shops, only online, and they can send between 100 to 6,000 volts into a dog's neck. Your standard plug socket in the UK supplies 230 volts. So, Erin, we'll start with you first of all. You say that this is, quite simply, you've been training dogs for 10, 11 years. Yeah. This is barbaric. I do. I think they're primitive. I don't think they are... I think they're unsophisticated. I don't think we need to use them any longer. I think we've got far better methods to be able to train dogs, even for chasing things like cattle and livestock, and I don't believe we need to continue using something like this at all. Well, James, you have used them, so, yes, uh, so what, what do you say to that? Many times over. Um, first of all, if, if you're talking about uh, electric shock, it's important... Um, if somebody said to me it's an electric shock, I only have my own image of what I consider that to be. Whereas when you actually feel a quality remote training collar, you're using, yes, you use the electronic circuit, but an electric shock is not what you will You've feel. You've got one so. there, Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, so you can, you can feel it and see. Well, uh, do, it, do it to me. Yeah, OK. So if you hold that one... So this has got a sliding scale, so it you has, adjust yeah. it depending on the size of the dog or the... Yes. So if I, t I bring this one up and I'll ask Philip to tell me when he can feel anything. Okay. But Philip's been warned that it's going to happen and dogs don't get warned that. OK. I feel a tingle in my palm now. OK. So a tingle in your palm, that's 15 out of 100 on yeah. that collar. So if you were a dog, yeah. what you would be looking to do is give the dog, as Erin as just said there, the, the control, the predictability and the controllability of the stimulation and what's required. That is not going to harm a dog. But that's not even going to frighten a dog. Theoretically, I've electrocuted you, Philip. Well, that's what people use the word electric. But the right. human's dermal layer is thinner. Don't put it's that th down th thicker, sorry, than a dog's. So your dermal layer, your epidermis, is thicker than a dog's. Yeah. So where, how you can you can't even compare what you're feeling to what you put on a dog. Equally, depending on when you're using it, if a dog is under stress or is heightened to, my working cocker will chase through things and everything else. He loves finding scents. His adrenaline's so high that in order to be able to get any response from that, you'd have to have it a lot higher than that. Uh, so so whack it up. Okay. OK. OK, so that's now... That's a pot... That, what's that up to? 24. 24. And that goes up to 100. Yep. That's beginning to get slightly uncomfortable. Yep. And I put it up to 30. 30. Yeah. I'm going to have to let go because it will time out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's feature, OK, so put it up to 30. Bring it back again. OK. Yeah, that, now that is beginning to make my... Is that 30? 36. Yeah. I mean, it's not, it's not hurting me. But it is. But you, you know, do it's just understand beginning, I'm beginning what it to is. Feel moving my do dogs? Well. How? I mean, how? How can a dog understand this? So they, I mean, it's got to hurt. It's got to feel wrong for them not to want to do it again. Surely that's the whole. It depends premise. on the circumstances that you're talking about. Ollie, to be completely honest, if you're talking about wanting to develop a, 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 a deliberate negative association, livestock worrying is is the, the stop one that people would talk about. And if we're going to say that it's legally justifiable to, to kill a dog, you can shoot it. You know, if it's chasing livestock because you're acting in the interests of all animals concerned. Mm. And that's ethical, ethically OK, that's legally OK. But if we're saying that to deliver a fraction of a second startle to that dog, as it does that, so that it forms the association, performing this behaviour results in that negative consequence, I won't do it. And does it work? Is it quick? Yes, it's incredibly it? quick. It's incredibly quick, but it must be done under professional supervision. You need high-quality equipment taught by somebody with a high level of knowledge and understanding of behaviour, of dogs, of training. So a dog will learn, uh, if it is attacking livestock, that, uh, you know, uh, ow, hang on a second, uh, that, that, that hurt, I'm not going to do this. You won't have to keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing it, because the dog will learn. If it's worked, if you've used it at a level that's going to punish that behaviour, so positive punishment is adding something to decrease a behaviour. They're adding this to be able to decrease a behaviour. You can keep a dog on lead, you can teach it a really reliable recall, you can definitely build prey drive through the humans, you can do scent work, you can do lots and lots of wonderful things with dogs to be to chase and herd but is that going to take else? a really long time? So you, you, do you think, really, this is just for people who are a bit lazy and want I don't think results? it's just for people that are lazy. I Thank think you. a lot of it is for people that don't necessarily understand how to use it. I'm not saying that Jamie isn't one of those people. No. But Jamie and I are both in a lot of agreement that he says that these would need to be licensed. Well, the dog training industry isn't licensed. It's right. not regulated. And right now, mm. these are available to Joe Public. And that's And Joe danger. Public can whack them up to 100 if it hasn't worked the first time. There is and they a definite haven't need. Uh, are you OK? There is a definite need for... Some form of restriction. Um, they're banned in Wales. They're set to be banned in Scotland. Um, and uh, and so, uh, should they be banned here? 100%. Philip, they're not set to be banned in Scotland. Scotland is looking to introduce legislation, restrictive legislation. They've got it right. What Scotland is looking to do is right. Um, same as uh, Belgium, uh, you know, the Netherlands, is basically introduce restrictive legislation. Mm. There's never been a criminal conviction mm. for cruelty. The law exists. 2006 Animal Welfare Act. It exists to um, cover unnecessary suffering. There's never been one. 
The RSPCA do over 100 or 150,000 investigations that lead to prosecutions as well. There's never been one. Turn it up to 100. Oh, God. Really? OK. Is that 100? No. no. Oh, wait, well, don't that? do it then. Don't. That's 30. 33. 33. Don't turn it up then. Do you, to take, do you want me to take Turn it up to 100? Okay. No! Ready? Is that 100? Oh, my gosh. Oh, I'm going to take it up to 100 for you. I'd okay. That's, that's really quite uncomfortable. Is well. that 72? Okay, don't ah, do it I anymore. Can't. What was that? 83. 83. Yeah. Well, wow. Can I just make a point? Would you wow. now say that you were afraid of the sofa or that you're afraid of me? I'm not coming anywhere you're near you. <laughs> <laughs> do, are you genuine, genuinely, would you say that you're afraid of me? Have you developed a, a superstitious He's association? He's got an understanding. Yeah, absolutely. Right. This, I this, can't this is where it's so important. This is where it's so important, Holly, that we allow the dog to work. I let go of that at 83. A dog can't let go of that. No, let's say that that was a sheep. Would you go after it again? If that were the consequence for going after it, would you go after it? You're not harmed. You're not physically harmed. I think you harmed can't compare like the human brain and an no, you animal can't. brain. No, you can't. Because the understanding is there. better ways to train animals, and there's far more that you can do to be able to help them in that circumstance. And quite honestly, the problem is, is that if you're only using this for sheep worrying, you're no, not no, looking no, at yeah. the access. Okay, we, we are. We are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it, it really is. Thank, thank you very well. But thank yeah. you very much indeed. Thank, thank you. you. Are you all right? Yeah, fine. Good.